happy morning dear students uh, today we are going to discuss the objective model questions in our engineering physics so if you look at the observe the screen then you will easily understand the uh, how the model questions will be asking in our examinations first if you observe the first one which of the following does not show any interference pattern example a so bubble b excessively thin film a thin film d wedge is method so among these four options b is the right answer excessively thin film generally does not uh, exhibit the interference pattern second one if you observe clearly the main principle used in the interference is superposition principle that is option b is correct when two waves of same amplitude add constructively the intensity becomes four times because intensity and the amplitude relation is intensity i equal to square of amplitude the next one the shape of the fringes observed in the newton's rings interference is circular rings so option b is the correct answer if instead of monochromatic light white light is used for interference of light what would be the change in the observation then colored fringes will be observed with a white light bright fringe at the center instead of dark fringe bright fringe center you will observe it next one interference is observed only when the phase difference between the two waves is zero that is that is wrong not only zero if it is also constant then you can so option b is the right answer according to cosine law the expression for the maxima is 2 mu t cos r equal to n lambda that is for the maxima 2n plus 1 into lambda by 2 option c is the right answer in the newton ring experiment the diameter of it is a numerical problem if you solve it then you will get the answer as 1.25 meters which of the following phenomena is observed in the following figure if you observe clearly then you can easily identify that it is a newton ring experiment option d is the right answer and then coming to when the white light is incident on a di diffraction grating the light diffracted more will be a blue b yellow c green d red red light will be diffracted more the transverse nature of the light is as shown in the figure as shown by transverse nature of light is observed by the polarization in positive crystals option c is the right answer in positive crystals the velocity of the ordinary ray is generally greater than the velocity of extraordinary ray option a is the right answer the example for uniaxial crystal is calcite is the uniaxial crystal nickel prism is based on the principle of double refraction so option b is the correct answer in doubly refracted crystal uh, along the optic axis option c is correct answer that is refractive index of the ordinary ray is equal to refractive index of extraordinary ray and then now if you observe clearly 18th one the expression for the half wave plate is p equal to lambda by 2 mu o minus mu e option b is the right answer polarizing angle for air glass interface is option b is the correct answer 57 degrees the angle between the plane of polarization and the plane of vibration is c 90 degrees option c is the right answer in double refraction crystal the velocity of extraordinary is same in all directions that is option b is the right answer velocity of ordinary ray next If you observe clearly, a polarizer is used to produce polarized light. Option A is the correct answer. Next, twenty-third one. An example of negative crystal is a calcite crystal is the right answer. The phenomena of which causes the polarization of light is option B, double refraction. The angle of refraction of the completely polarized light is thirty-five degrees. Then, if you observe, substitute in mu equal to ten p. then you will get the answer as 1.43 option c is the right answer the condition for the principal maxima in fraunhofer diffraction due to grating is 
ऑप्शन डी इज द राइट आंसर ई प्लस डी साइन थीटा इक्वल टू प्लस आर माइनस एन लैम्डा ए लीनियरली पोलराइज्ड वेव इज ऑलवेज ऑप्शन सी लॉन्गिट्यूडनल वेव ऑप्शन सी इज द राइट आंसर नेक्स्ट वन द वेलोसिटी ऑफ वेलोसिटी ऑफ वाटर इज 1.5 एंड 10 पावर 8 द प्रॉब्लम इज गिवन द if we substitute it in the formula then you will get 63 degrees 43 minutes what should be the thickness of the quarter wave plate for a light of wavelength 5000 angstrom this is also problem if you solve it you will get 1.38 into 10 power minus 3 cm unpolarized light is incident on a plane glass surface what should be the angle of incidence that is option c 57 degrees If you observe the problems uh, in the unit two model questions, which of the following crystal is an example of monoclinic? CaSO4, calcium sulfate. Which of the following Bravais lattice is not found in cubic crystal? Option D, base centered. Is the right answer. The packing fraction for diamond crystal structure is option A, thirty-four degrees. Thirty-four percent is the coordination number in the case of simple cubic crystal is. Simple cubic, it is six. That is option B is the right answer. Which of the following crystalline is FCC structure? Option A, aluminium is the correct answer. The number of molecules present in unit cell of the sodium chloride is option C, four. The relation of the length of the axis of unit cell in monochromatic crystal system is option B. A is not equal to B is not equal to C. The coordination number for face-centered cubic is option A, twelve. The relation along the angle between the axis of triclinic crystal system is option C. Alpha is not equal to beta is not equal to gamma, not equal to ninety degrees. And then the packing density of the body-centered cube is option B, root three by eight into pi. Tenth one option B is the correct answer. Eleventh one atomic radius per radius simple cubic lattice is option A A by two. The atomic packing fraction is minimum value for option A simple cubic structure. Diamond shows the option B FCC structure. The NaCl crystal has option B face centered cubic structure. Crystal of hexagonal lattice is. A equal to B and not equal to C. Option D is the right answer. Fifteenth one, sixteenth one. The lattice constant for a given cubic structure can be expressed as option B. N M by N A. That is Avogadro number into rho whole power root uh, whole one by three. Seventeenth one. Interatomic distance between the N A and C L is option A. Two point eight one angstroms. All types of Bravais lattice observed in B are thorambic. The unit cell for most of the crystals are parallel piped. Option C is the right answer. The number of crystal systems are option B seven. The number of Bravais lattices are option C fourteen. If the periodicity of the atoms or molecules is extended. In a large number of small regions of B, that is polycrystalline solid, different sizes in the known so known as polycrystalline solids. Twenty third one, using powder diffraction, dash of a crystal can be determined. Option B, the interplanar spacing of the crystal can be determined. In powder method, dash chromatic x-rays can be used monochromatic x-rays can be used option a is the right answer if the path difference between the x-rays are reflected by the successive crystal planes is n lambda where n equal to 1 to 3 the intensity of diffracted ray is maximum that is option b bragg's law next one 26th de bayes method of x-ray diffraction is das powder crystal method 27 miller indices represent the following of the crystal option d planes of the crystal 28 x rays are used for diffraction studies in a crystal because option c wavelength of radiation is same range as that of the interatomic spacing 
29th one. If the path difference between X rays are referred by the successive planes, lambda by 2, 3 lambda by 2, 5 lambda by 2, then the intensity of the diffracted ray is minimum. Option B is the right answer. The Bragg's law is 2D sin theta equal to N lambda. Option A is the right answer. So these are the model objective questions for your mid-examination one. Thank you all. All the best.